If you're looking for a great seamless way to really integrate an aftermarket car stereo, the Car Show vehicle specific kits are a great solution because they're made for your vehicle. For example, here we have one that's in a Volkswagen CC. And you'll see here, it looks just like a factory stereo. Pull the old one out, you put it in. Installation really is simple. You don't need to get a, uh, an aftermarket dash kit or anything like that because it uses the factory panels and just replaces that factory stereo, except it's gonna give you more features. One thing that's really nice about the car show vehicle specific is that it integrates with your car. Uh, meaning the steering wheel controls, the Bluetooth that's already in this car are retained and it's all built in to the piece. Um, so when you're shopping for these things, be sure to check the vehicle specs because if you have Sync, if you have OnStar, if you have your Bose system, if you have any of those vehicle specific peripherals, there's a good chance that these units are going to integrate seamlessly with that without, the, uh, without having to buy any additional modules or anything like that. But let me give you a walkthrough of some of the features that this has. So right now I have the navigation up. Um, this is the iGo interface powered by Navtech Maps. So it's gonna be very simple to use and it's gonna provide a, all the NAP databases that you could, you could ever want. Um, you'll see up here we have the kind of our quick shortcut where you have custom icons and um, settings here with your volume down here at the bottom. Um, brightly colored, easy to see in both day and night. Um, and here we have a destination, so it's giving you your distance, your time left, your arrival time, um, has kind of your, your next step right up here on what street. So one thing that's nice about these vehicle specific integration pieces is it adds these dedicated source buttons and controls over here. So now, whereas other touch screens, you have to go to the touch screen menu to kind of go through and do a lot of things. Here, if I want to switch to the disc, I just push disc and it's going to bring it up. It also has more sources along here at the bottom. And let's talk about these ones down here. So down here with the AM and FM, it still gives you kind of your full AM FM radio controls. You have all your different presets that you can scroll through by pushing your AM FM to change from your uh, different settings here. You have your seek functionality in here. And one thing that's nice, where if let's say I'm on FM3 and I want to um, you know, take this station here and save it. Um, over this one right here. All I have to do is push and hold, and now it stores it right there. iPod, I push that, and it's now connected to the iPod that I have connected in my glove box. So it's out of sight, but I'm still able to go in, get full ID3 tagging, and all of that type of stuff, full control um, from the iPod, just as I would expect in any other type of interface. CD, DVD, um, again, using this slot right up here, and I'm gonna be compatible with all your different media, your CDs, your um, MP3s, your WMAs, your all your DVDs. You can burn your discs at home. You can just bring them in, do all that stuff. Um, and then your DVDs, it gives you full control over the videos and all that stuff. We actually don't have a DVD in right now, which is why it's not letting me. But one thing that's really cool is this MP3 uh, button over here. Essentially, what they're doing is the car show allows you to put a disc in, save it to an internal hard drive, and then remove that, and you can still retain that MP3 on here. Think of it like a five disc CD changer without the CD changer because it's storing it digitally inside the unit. So it's pretty cool. You know, you can bring a CD, a friend brings a CD over, you put it in, you save it to your system, they take their CD, you still get the music on one of these different disc tracks. So kind of like a digital six di or five disc changer, kind of cool. And this fully integrates in with your phone. We don't have a, the phone connected right now. However, it gives you the controls to do so. Um, when you pair it, and it gives you the passcode so you're able to easily pair your phone with this device. And then once it's connected, you're still gonna be able to make and receive calls right from the unit using the integrated system inside this Volkswagen. So it's very convenient um, and allows you to do that quickly and easily. Now, another thing that's cool is right up here, um, you have a mini USB right on the front that allows you to connect this to an, like a USB thumb drive, for example, or a jump drive. And you're able to now take that digital music and play it through your device here. Now, some other cool features um, you have, if I will go back to the AM FM, so, so you can see the screen, is this display button. You can push this and you can go into nighttime mode to manually override the automatic settings that go, or you can put it into what's called stealth mode, where it goes black. Now, in the background, you still get to hear all the music and all of that stuff that's playing. As you can hear, as I turn up the, turn up the volume, this is great 
for when you're driving at nighttime and you don't want to have a bright display in your face. You just want to be able to hear your music without the display. And to make things even more convenient, it has the support for backup cameras. So for example, if I put this into reverse, you would get the backup camera input. Um, so if your vehicle has a backup camera or you want to add a backup camera, the vehicle specific car show unit is going to support it. So overall, this is a great way for you to really get an, an aftermarket unit that integrates with your system, gives you a bunch more features in your car without the aftermarket look. So it's a great OEM feel with the great aftermarket features. This is the Car Show Vehicle Specific Integration Units. And for more information on these and to find the unit right for your application, head on over to sonicelectronics.com.